inside an aircraft magneto. Here we have an aircraft magneto. And if I turn it over, it's been beautifully sectioned uh, so that we can see what's going on inside. So here we see the shaft that is turned by the engine to make the electricity for the spark plugs. And what have we got inside? Well, we've got a permanent magnet here. There's one of the poles of the magnet. And there's the other pole. And here we have what are called pole shoes. Uh, so when when this permanent magnet is is turned, rotated, the pole shoes are connected to the coil, the orange coil, uh, and there's an iron bar that uh, forms the core. Uh, and when the magnets, the magnet is turned, a uh, a current will be produced in the in the coil and here we have two coils of wire. We have a primary coil it's a relatively small number uh, of coils uh, and this is part of the primary circuit and then the uh, outside that is a very large number of very fine wires and the coil converts the low voltage to a high voltage and the high voltage comes out of the coil through this contact point and through onto this wheel and out um, along this thing called a finger to one of the four spark plug wires. There's only two visible, there's another two over here. So that's how that works. Now here we also have a set of contact points in there that are uh, opened and closed by a little a little cam that's on the end of that's uh, just inside this small white nylon wheel. So there's a little cam in there that opens and closes the contact points and that uh, is so that we only get a, a pulse of electricity through the primary coils when the when the north and south magnetic poles are at the best position to to generate this current the primary current uh, so what else have we got we've got a capacitor here uh, that is so that the so that we don't get arcing across the points and we have a connection there that's for the P lead that's for the connection to the magneto switch that's how we ground the magneto and make it make it inactive uh, so that it will not fire so briefly that's what's going on let's let's turn it some more There is no electrical connection across the the small and large nylon wheels. The, the small wheel is turning the large wheel, and the large wheel, all the large wheel is doing, is taking the the high voltage pulse of electricity and taking it out through this finger to one of the four high tension, high voltage leads uh, and then out to a spark plug. No battery required, you're just generating high voltage for the spark plug uh, through mechanical means only.